Libra, welcome in to the Gifted Hermit. I hope you're doing well. If you're new to the channel, hello, my name's Leela. I reside in the UK, London. Where are you from? My darlings, I mean, it's not looking good, my darlings. Libras, I suppose if you've come in here, then there's reasons why you're here, right? Ten of Wands, Nine of Swords, I mean, damn. You've got a lot of, lot of shit on your shoulders. You can see it there in the illustration. My lovelies, please remember to give me a thumbs up if you find that this reading resonates with you in any way. It really does help the channel. My moon's in Libra. You guys are so loving, so giving. Um, yeah, you've had a lot on your shoulders recently, Libra. This could be just life in general. I think for a lot of you, there's a connection here that you guys are still... There's, there's hurt here. You know, Nine of Swords. This talks about uh, depression, anxiety... So whatever it is, uh, I'm sure it will get better. <sighs> now, for some of you, this could be, there's a fire sign here for some of you. Could be an Aries, could be a Leo. And I pick up on whoever this person is. It doesn't have to be a fire sign. You could be dealing with any sign, all right? I'm going to try and keep it as general as possible. But um, someone's left you feeling really confused here. All right? Could be an Aries. Uh, someone could have options here maybe you're thinking about have I made the wrong choice you're feeling very confused emotionally with regards to somebody in your life for some of you it's this Aries okay for some of you it could be somebody that is in a higher position or a position of authority okay so it doesn't have to be a love connection but there's definitely shit going on for for a lot of libras it seems okay communication none for some of you this ten of cups in reverse is three of swords in reverse you know it's like damn ten of cups in the reverse position is disharmony it is disputes it's miscommunication it's struggling relationships you know there's there's been some struggle here for you guys all right some of you may be not feeling uh worthy of love not feeling good enough sometimes you know when we have a disconnect or disharmony there's a breakup somebody cheats it makes you question everything some of you are finding it hard to accept something here and you're being you're, you're feeling stuck in this sadness in this grief you need to heal libra you need to heal quite frankly uh that's the goal here for a lot of you we've got the six of cups the six of cups is you thinking thinking about maybe someone from the past romanticizing about someone from the past there's a lot of nostalgia here um maybe you're going to be starting to reconnect because i asked about uh, what's coming towards you okay and we got the five of pentacles with the six of cups so for some of you you're going to be getting back with your person some of you are going to make up all right but uh, a lot of you are stuck in the past stuck in this breakup stuck in this feeling left out maybe you're feeling like the black sheep of the family feeling like nothing's ever going right for you maybe you're having some financial difficulty uh, difficulties for some libras right um here you are on the bottom of the deck what you're unaware of you're going to be listening to your intuition you're going to be going within and tapping into your subconscious your feelings your imagination all the stuff uh, there's going to be stuff coming to the surface all right it, things will change you will get back into your power we've got cancer energy here okay so i feel like a lot of you are going to be getting back into that determined energy be very mindful of how you spend your money okay any any money that comes in, just budget, be very mindful. I know you're finding it hard to perhaps let go and come out of this rut, this dark energy for some of you, or this sadness, this anxiety. Uh, you got to understand that you're not to blame, okay? Because this King of Cups, I don't like him. Some of you could be dealing with a Cancer Pisces Scorpio. This energy in the reverse position, he's a player, he is a drama queen, drama king, whatever way you, you want to put it, all right? A lot of you need to find your independence again, all right? It's important for you to regain your power, step into your into your power, all right? Um, something was expected, something needed to happen here. 
It was inevitable. Okay, life, maybe you feel like it's becoming a bit stale. You feel like you're trying to avoid everything at all costs. You're trying to avoid anything bad going wrong again or further adding to your distress. Okay, some of you are finding it hard to... You're refusing to change something here. Some of you are in fear of the under, uh, of the unknown and in denial about something that that doesn't really serve you, to be fair. Page of Wands, you know, maybe some of you are, you're needing to take action. You're needing to express something here. You need to take that next step and step out of this Five of Cups. A lot of you are finding it very hard, struggling right now. Maybe some of you are getting a bit too worked up maybe you've been stuck in this rut too long Libra and now you need to push past it all right maybe you manifested the wrong thing maybe you were manipulated you were cheated on you were tricked you can give yourself permission to start again start afresh Gemini Virgo energy there yeah time to be truthful to yourself for some of you you know maybe you got your clarity maybe you got your answer It's time to cut out the bullshit. Anytime I see the Ace of Swords, it's like, yeah, time to cut out the bullshit now. You guys are strong. You can do this, Libra. You know, I don't see you having, um, yeah, trying to find that balance. A lot of you are trying to stay busy, trying to juggle your responsibilities, trying to have a balance, trying to be flexible, trying to stay busy. You've got a decision that you need to make. Are you going to stay in this rut or are you going to move forward? Are you going to stay in the darkness or are you going to make the darkness come to light? Are you going to face your fears? Are you going to face your subconscious? Bring those feelings to light. Some of you may be dealing with a cancer here. You're feeling very sensitive right now. I get it. Confused. Unsure. Unsure of the unknown of the future. You'll be all right. Um, you'll be all right. You need to let go. A lot of you are really finding it hard to let go. Be kind to yourself, okay? It's really... Okay, so open up. Open up your eyes to the possibilities. Be truthful to yourself. Regain your independence. Time to enjoy life. And remember who you are. And be grateful for what it is that you do have. Be looking at the positives rather than the negatives. Right, Libra, angels. What's the guidance for Libra? reward yourself wow flipped right out libra you've been giving a lot of yourself lately and it's time for you to receive make the time to reward yourself in a meaningful way this balance of giving and receiving is essential to keeping your energy mood and motivation at a consistently high level okay it's time to be kind to yourself remember you know, you, you're giving too much. You need to find that balance. If you give too much, what's, what's going to be left for you? What's going to be left for you? Right, Libra? Angels, anything else for Libras? Anything else? Yeah, you see, here we go. Daydream, it came out reverse. So a lot of you are kind of... Um, you're focusing your energy on the wrong things. Let's see what it says. You will move easily here and receive our messages if you daydream regularly, Libra. Relax and open your mind to receiving. Without directing your thoughts, just notice any feelings, visions or ideas as if you were watching a movie. This is the seat of creativity. See, and a lot of you got um, a lot of dreams, you know, a lot of projects, a lot of ambition, finding it hard to to get them get them moving right the entire universe operates in cycles similar to you breathing in and breathing out when you only give or you only receive you become out of rhythm with the universe for optimal health energy and replenishment balance each breathing in with breathing out okay so balance your giving and your receiving be mindful of who you give your time and your energy to be remember be mindful of not burning out all right, and reward yourself, be kind to yourself. It's time to treat yourself, it's time to be kind to yourself. Regain your independence and step out of this dark energy that you don't need to be in. This is low vibrational. You guys are, are so loving and bubbly. Be truthful to yourself, open your eyes um, and see shit for what it really is, all right? 
I'm here to support you. You guys can reach out to, to me. My number's there in the about section. You can book me for a personal. You can catch me for live tarot. I hope you enjoyed this reading and you found it somewhat insightful. Please remember to give me a thumbs up. Be kind to others. But most importantly, be kind to you, Libra. All right? Don't ever forget that. Take care, my loves.